Hello guys. Well, today we have a vocabulary class. Yep. And this is about classroom objects. Exactly. Here's what I got. Let me show you. This is the picture. All right. Let me make it a little bigger. Not that much. Okay. So, can you see this picture? This picture here. Okay, so here we have one, two, three, four, five, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14 objects. Do you know their names? Do you know the names of these objects? Let's see some easy ones. For example, number three. What is this? This is a book, right? Well, how about the rest? Let's see the list of names. Okay. Here, there is a list of 14 names that you have to match with the pictures. Let's see the pronunciation of these names. I'm going to open here the dictionary. I'm using Cambridge Dictionary Online. Well, I prefer the option. You can open this part here, this tab, and you probably will find many different options. This English Portuguese gives you the translation in Portuguese. But I prefer to use this one, Essential American English. So you come here and you type the words from the list. First word. That's. And then you can listen and read the pronunciation. Here we have the phonetic transcription. And you can listen to the pronunciation too. Book. Book. Can you repeat that? Book. Here you have a description in English and examples. Let's see the second word. Eraser. 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 It's a short E. 
Next. I tried to hear the name, but there is no audio available. There are two possibilities of spelling a school bag together or school bag separate. Here you have the phonetic transcription. So we have here school bag. And this is me. <laughs> All right. I'm not very well in this video. I didn't put makeup and I'm still a little sick. Let's go. Next word. Pencil sharpener. Very fast, right? So we have pencil sharpener. Pencil sharpener. Next one. Calculator. 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 Next. We have the British and the American pronunciation. Let's go for the American. Notepad. Notepad. So you repeat. Notepad. This one? Rubber band. Rubber band. Very fast, right? Then we have rubber band. Rubber band. Next word. Big two. And there is no audio available. Mechanical pencil. Mechanical pencil. From here, you can get an idea on the pronunciation. In UK, they say properly pencil. If you have problems with words or expressions, if they really represent the object you're thinking, you just Google it, right? You go on Google Images, you type the name, and you see the corresponding image. And if that is really what you're thinking, mechanical pencil. Next one. Notebook. Notebook. Your turn to repeat. Let's go for the next. Pen. Pen. Your turn. You know. CD player. CD player. CD player. Me again. CD player. Next one. Paperclip. Paperclip. So, paperclip. That's a good one. And how about this? Envelope. 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 Pay attention to the spelling. E N V E L O P E. Because there is envelope without E. Envelope without E is a verb. It's different from the object. The object is a noun. Okay? This is simply a name. The object. All right? And the last name is? 
Cell phone. Cell phone. Can you repeat it? Cell phone. This name you probably already know from the previous classes, right? So, what do you need to do now? You need to look at this picture. Here. And write the number on a piece of paper and after you write the correct name so you write number one in your list and then you write on words the names of the objects okay can you do that and then i go back to help you with the answers So guys, now it's your turn to do the activity. What you need to do, look at the image and write on a piece of paper the number and the name that corresponds to that object. There are 14 numbers, 14 names, okay? So, Next video, I correct this and we are going to talk about colors. So, see you soon. Bye.